What is up everyone and welcome back to part two of Hungary in this minor let's play. Uh, I did upload a previous video of Serbia versus Germany which I did what like yesterday and uh, obviously I've mentioned this before me returning back to YouTube and uploading Supreme Ruler videos weekly uh, is starting slow. I'm not gaining that much viewership or subscribers as I used to years ago when I started uploading uh, Supreme Ruler videos and streams like daily. Obviously I'm doing like I'm uploading videos like once or twice weekly because again sometimes work gets in the way sometimes I just want to have time for myself and play Genshin Impact sometimes I'm just lazy and I want to sleep and whatnot so bear in mind uh, that's why I don't upload like Supreme Ruler videos daily like I used to and then again ho I'm hoping I'm hoping that viewership and subscribers start to uh, run up and I can gain more viewers as I used to because right now things are starting slow still I've already been into this like a month already when I started uploading Supreme Ruler videos again so hopefully that changes by the end of the month or by summer actually by the end of summer where people all viewers and you were new viewers excuse me come back to my channel and are are like oh wow he's uploading videos again oh it's supreme ruler wow i missed that uh so that's what i'm hoping for and again if you want to support me there's a patreon link below because that's where usually the best support will be for me so that I can continue to upload Supreme Ruler videos because, because I still have a lot to talk about and to upload, whether it's versus, let's plays, and that one video where I need to talk about uh, Supreme Ruler the next generation and what I want to expect from Battlegold Studios and the future of Supreme Ruler games. So that will happen, yeah, that'll happen very, very soon, and I can't wait to do that video. Nonetheless, we're focusing on Hungary here. In part one, I did annex Slovakia. And for this part, I will be annexing my neighbors, Austria, and probably Slovenia as well in this part. As long as I keep this video under 15 minutes. Oh, and another thing. Uh, I have been thinking about doing Ukraine versus Russia. Now, don't get heated in the comments. Uh, I stay away from all that stuff, the geopolitical stuff in the scene. You guys can talk about that all you want in the comments, but I just won't like interfere or get into that kind of stuff. But I've been thinking about doing a Ukraine versus Russia versus, even though I'm kind of against it because of the stuff that's going on in the real world. But this right here, we're gonna keep it in the game. This is only going to be for entertainment purposes. Again, you guys can talk about it all you want in the comments. I just won't get into that stuff. But if you want to see a Ukraine versus Russia versus, which I have not planned or listed on my Patreon as well, then you can leave your comments below. Just leave Ukraine or Russia. But I'll be playing as Ukraine, obviously, for purposes. That are not specific. Um, yeah, you can leave whatever you want if you want to see Ukraine versus Russia. That's up to you. I could make a poll, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to let you guys decide in the comment section below. So, if you want to see a Ukraine versus Russia versus, just let me know. Without a further ado, actually, I should probably let my units like relax and repair and whatnot because we just got through a war which is what I'm gonna do right now I should gather all my units real quick Austria's capital is right there so Vienna oh my gosh I forgot about the tips I thought I disabled that in the last part uh, repair all my air units here I mean, it's been a while since I did upload like two videos in a week, since I really didn't upload that much last week either. So this makes up for it, at least. Alright, so I think we're ready to engage Austria. 
We only got one garrison, so it's fine. I should probably add like two garrisons to Bratislava just in case Austria does like invade and take the capital city or former capital city, excuse me. Uh, India, Philippines, North Korea, that's the usual stuff. South Korea, whatever. Finland, I'll take the rubber, thank you. Wow, I'm almost out of money too. That's not good at all. Well, I gotta take Austria because they have a large amount of treasury, as you can see. Roughly 13 billion dollars, so let's do that right now. I'm gonna let them come in, obviously. That's what she said. <laughs> uh, I, I saved myself right there. I usually don't even use that, like it's overused joke. But I just reminded myself of like, The Office. I've been watching The Office clips again. That show, still one of the best shows of this uh, century. But I just reminded myself of that, of Michael Scott. Anyways, enough of The Office. Um, there we go. Can we... No, we're not going to do that, I guess. Actually, maybe I can. I'll just try to take out the fabrication base because, again, the artillery units is what is going to like mess up my units the most. No, just artillery units in there. We took Austria's capital, Vienna, and boom. An axe. There we go. Austria has been annexed. Easy done. Easy said. Repair that air unit. I wish I didn't destroy that many of their units. I wanted to keep some, but it's fine. Because it looks like we will have time to attack Slovenia down south. Whoa, what's this? Oh, it's German units. That's right. In case you don't remember, I have an alliance with Germany and Bulgaria. And then I made an alliance with Greece just because they were attacked by... <laughs> oh my god. Uh, oh. Crap. I didn't even realize. Wait, what, what happened? Germany has declared war on Serbia. Oh, for crying out loud. Okay, well... Hmm. This kind of changes up the perspective. The... The... The geographic map here. So, Turkey annexed Greece. Germany declared war on Serbia. Um... I wasn't paying attention at all. Maybe I could have helped Greece a bit, but they've been annexed by Turkey. That That is kind of scary because I don't have any uh, treaties with them, no non-aggression pact. So they could attack me at any point if I do neighbor uh, Turkey's border. But the other thing is Serbia. Do I want to, like... <sighs> hmm... Should I let Germany keep Serbia? You know what? I probably will let Germany take Serbia. I'm gonna let Germany do that. Right now my goal is just to take Slovenia, Croatia, Serb Republic, Bosnia, Montenegro, Kosovo, Albania, and North Macedonia. And if I want to extend this minor let's play, I'm going to let you guys decide if I should annex Romania as my last country. Other than that, that was that's this is a minor let's play, okay? That's just the goal here. But I'm just going to let Germany take Serbia. I'm not going to interfere. Let them do their own thing. What's the timer now? At? Nine minutes? All right, let's get this going. Have fun, Germany. Good luck and Godspeed. I'm just gonna repair some of my units real quick here. I think that should. Those are all howitzers. I don't care about my artillery that much. I mean, it looks like Germany's kind of struggling. If Germany can't. Alright, so here's the deal. If Germany can't. Uh, Anak Serbia, then I'll probably 
try to annex it for myself. But for the time being, I think my biggest threat is Turkey. If I ever do, like, try to get close to their borders. Because I do want Albania and North Macedonia. Is there another war? India, Bangladesh. <laughs> okay. Let's do this. Add one garrison, add one garrison. Hmm. Oh, well, actually, it looks like Germany doesn't even need any help. That's all they needed to do. Now that they have, like, a piece of territory from them, then that's all they need. That's going to be easier for them to get through. My turn. There, we got their cap. That's not their capital. What? I was mistaken. This is their capital. Oh, yeah, now we did. No, oh, don't destroy the units. I need those. Oh, goodness. There we go. An axe. Alright, so we got Slovenia down. They've been annexed. Bangladesh is gone as well. They've been annexed by India. As you can see. I forgot that Nepal was gone as well because of China annexing them. North Korea is about bound to fall, like for the trillionth time in Supreme Ruler history. In every Supreme Ruler game, it's always them getting annexed. <clears throat> Alright then, so that's that. Let's check the view empire. By the way, in case you didn't know, that little part of Austria in like Western Austria is gone, like the panhandle. That was given to. Italy and Germany for some apparent reason like they took a couple of villages from me It's whatever But the Austro-Hungarian Empire is coming to its full glory slowly, but surely I annexed Austria I annexed Slovenia Germany is busy with Serbia I did a versus of that complete failure complete disaster Greece is gone to my surprise but other than that um, so far so good I'm enjoying this let's play with Hungary and we'll see when I continue in part three and again quick reminder if you want to see Ukraine versus Russia just let me know in the comments below and as always subscribe like and I'll see you guys next time I clicked the wrong I clicked the wrong key to end or pause or stop the recording, excuse me. It's alt nine, not control nine. Alright. For real this time. I'll see you guys next time.